Here's a sensitive topic. Why do hairstylists cut off way too much when it's still done every three months? I don't know. I'm not sure what your regimen is in between those three months. Is the hair damaged every three months? Is your regimen damaging? Um, are they not cutting off what needs to come off? Is it, the, is it, are they the same hairstylist cutting off every time? Are they prepping the hair properly? Or are you having clear discussions about where you wanna go with your hair? Um, or do you have hair goals? Is it to grow longer? Um, my experience is that Generally, women um, with a kinkier, tighter texture um, that run into this problem are not moisturizing their hair or caring for it through proper wash and go and or proper protective styles. Ideal if your hair is naturally dry, right? Everything that you do to it, it's like your hair is your favorite cashmere sweater. Everything that you do to it, whether it's through washing, frequent wash and go styling or prepping it properly to do a protective style that gets you five to ten days of a style um, greatly depends on keeping the hair moisturized and soft because there's only two sides to, to dry there's soft and then there's brittle and brittle hair breaks so or the strands split or dry out more frequently one of the things that I've run into with women who have been had a haircut a year or several years whose hair is intact and I can't understand why. And then they tell me that, oh, I do wash and go styling every day. I do it almost twice a day. That can save your hair. Just to know that helps.